back. The ancient Greeks thought laughter literally healed people, and we all think they were definitely onto something. Yeah, so maybe you want to do something for your mental health. You can have a good laugh. You can start it today because we've got a comedy show for you. We've got House Farts Hi. in studio. Yeah, no pressure or whatever. <laughs> if you, I, I'd just like to say for anyone watching, if you have an open wound, um, I, we can't treat you. Go to an actual medical <laughs> facility. I don't want these women selling you a bill of goods. <laughs> This is not healthy. Um, yeah, but but on on a generalized level, yeah, releasing anxiety, uh, you know, which apparently a lot of people have. I don't. I know. wonder why. I don't. I, have no, I, I honestly <laughs> don't know why. You know, because my grandparents lived through World War II and I think ate nothing but tin, and somehow. <laughs> They, they never had a, a, like a bad holiday in their life. They're always like, it's Christmas time. And meanwhile, the rest of us are like, I've run out of things to binge watch. You know, <laughs> um, yeah. it's story. a nightmare. <laughs> it's, the, it's, it's the dust bowl of streaming. I don't know what you're like. <laughs> yeah, but I don't know what people who went through this, uh, the pandemic, are going to tell their grandchildren about their suffering on this one time. Postmates got a flat tire, you know, like <laughs> the Amazon boxes all came and the wind blew all the envelopes into a neighbor's yard and I didn't know if I was allowed to speak to him. <laughs> like that's, that's the extent. I mean, yeah. obviously there's a lot of horrible things going on genuinely in the world that I think we can all take heart in. And yeah. knowing that they're not on top of us currently. Mm. Absolutely. And so you had a show last night, and you got three shows. Yes. This weekend. Yes, I'm here. Awesome. Like, yeah, tonight, tomorrow night, and, and uh, Saturday, and then I'm, you know, and then I, yes, they're spread all over the. Go, go right there. There's the, there's the dates. I want to see everybody at all of them, by the way. Uh, unlike, <laughs> unlike a lot of these other comedy weaklings, I throw new stuff in all the time. Oh. I have to, like this one act. Who does that anymore? I mean, like three hours of material and an hour on stage. What am I? I mean, I'm basically up there with a crowbar talking as fast <laughs> as I possibly can. Like, just save all your laughs to the end. So yeah, it's good. It's it's lovely to get back out again, and it's lovely to see people back out again, even as awkward as they are. Yeah, like, people were socially awkward in general before all this nonsense, and now they're like, uh, sure, can I speak? Is does laughing <laughs> expel air with also <laughs> particles in it? Should I hold <laughs> like like everybody's laughing like a Vic, like a Victorian maid? Like, <laughs> oh, 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 sink me. <laughs> Yeah, which is good because, you know, people are disgusting. So, you know, like six foot distance, I mean, we should be doing that all the time. Mm -hmm. I've been advocating that my whole life. <laughs> but, yeah. Well, we chatted before the show. You said you're no stranger to, to Grand Rapids. No, no, no. I mean, I started, I went to high school in Chicago, started Second City when I was 15 years old, started doing stand up when I was 14, touring by the time I was 17. And I was driving, I could, I could do, when I was in high school, I could do any stand up gig. Um, that I could drive to and get back in time to be home for school or whatever. Oof. So I did wow. a lot of stuff in, <laughs> you know, in, in Michigan, Indiana, Wisconsin, you know, like doing the UP loop, you know, that <laughs> I kind don't of know stuff. if you can do the UP loop Oh, I've done the UP loop. I, my, uh, my band has played the UP a couple of times, and I literally at one point in one of the places we were playing, they, the people of the town had risen up and taken over the theater there, and I was, um, I was, I was all wireless, wireless headset, wireless microphone, wireless ear, uh, monitors and guitar and so I could literally walk off stage and I walked out into the town because the entire town was at the show oh yeah. and stood in the middle of the street soloing <laughs> and like I'm like this we've shut this place down <laughs> The, wow. the U, UP is basically a Twilight Zone episode waiting to happen. The <laughs> yeah. entire I've heard that. Yeah, it's, a, it's amazing. Go. No, <laughs> okay. definitely go. Don't go. Anyway, don't, don't go. Don't no, 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 no. You'll be. You know, don't. <laughs> no, no, you can go. You can't go. I, I, I don't. I, I feel you would get lost. I'm just saying. No, okay. I might. No All offense, right. UP. <laughs> but in other words, go to his shows. That's yeah. right. That's All where the you information. Housesparks.com, infotainmentwars.com. I don't need documents. We'll see you later. All right. Yeah. Thanks for being here. Yeah. Oh, that's the only way I could get here. Yeah. <laughs>